Hi, it's Hans at ahappierman.com. Today's topic is let time heal you. Oh, I've, you, you, things that go wrong in your life, whatever the wrong is, they're very traumatic and, and, and hard on you. And when they, when these kind of traumatic incidents happen, you have to let time work its magic on you. For example, I left my wife in the year 2007, it's 2021 as I'm speaking now, so that's a long time ago, right? 14 years, nearly 14. And, you, you know, the reasons I left her, I laid out in my book, Leave Your Wife and Become a Happier Man, with a three-step system available on the allhappierman.com website. But the things that were happening to me and, and the circumstances of why I left were very traumatic, very, very difficult, very frustrating, very just terrible, terrible things. And, and I guess what I'm suggesting is when I left, it wasn't like as soon as I left, everything just was all hunky-dory, nicey-nicey right away. It took a long time for things to get to the point where I'm a, a happier man and have been for some time and I've been controlled. I've been in control of my life and my circumstances for quite some time now. And, but let's say right after that event of leaving my wife, yeah, it was not that, things were not that great. They were in the, but they were in the process of starting to become great. Okay, when I was with my wife, I, there was no way for me to have a great life. It was only in the potential of leaving her where I would have a chance at a great life. And it's turned out that with you know my own efforts and just the passage of time and keeping positive on, on moving my life forward, that I've gotten to where I've gotten. So let's say for you, if you're if you're in a bad marriage, yeah, you could leave your wife today, and it might take you 10 years before you finally get to that happy point. But the, the but the problem with looking at it from how long things take are, if you don't do anything for yourself positively, you'll never you'll never get to a good place, right? So that's the that's the dilemma is. If you, if something is going wrong in your life, you have to make a big change to start making it right to give yourself a chance. And you have to give time a chance to work for you. That eventually you will work your way out of whatever bad situations you're in. So it could be, it could be this bad marriage that you leave and that, you know, in the aftermath of the leaving, it can throw your life just into a terrible spiral of other problems that will take even longer for you to work your way out of, right? Things with your children, things with your finances, things with your normal life that are just, you know, that are very, very, very difficult to work through. But you will work through them. You will work through them if you stay positive and allow time to heal you. You know, it, think of like an injury you hurt yourself you know some form or fashion you don't expect that you're gonna feel better the next day do you you expect it's gonna take a good long while before you you know really start to feel good again and that's time healing you and and some things if they've been really really difficult are gonna take a long long time like I hurt my elbow weight training in 2016 it's 25th 21 now and it's it's kind of starting to feel better right five years later <laughs> you know that's the kind of thing you have to keep in mind that you if that is going to take a long time for some things to heal but they will heal if you allow time to do 
so. What about your finances? Well, like I said, with the divorce, my finances, we, in my marriage, the finances were horrible. And then as a result of the divorce, they were even worse, right? I went from a bad situation to a worse situation. But over time, over time, paying my bills, paying down the debts, building up my savings, all of that stuff, getting more on firmer footing, the time has worked its magic where I can say I'm, I'm working my way toward a financial good place. But it takes time. It takes time, you know, and I think that's why a lot of us get caught up in this, uh, in these get rich quick schemes thinking that our finances can only improve if we do something dramatically fast and that that's kind of unusual that that's going to happen right it's very very unusual even the people who do get rich usually it's from many 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 years of sustained effort uh with of the single-minded goal of getting rich can a good dose of luck too um but it's time, the time, the time. So I went from a horrible credit rating to a very, very good credit rating, and I can't, the time is, well, paying the bills on time and work, working them, working down the debts, right? So it's simple, it's easy, but it takes time. And that's what I would suggest to you is let the time work its magic on you. Focus on your own life. If something is really, really wrong, Ah, you got to make it right. Um, I wouldn't, if I, you know, the, the, the most detrimental thing for people is if you're married to somebody who's not good for you. That will just ruin your entire life. So I, I would call that the most important part of your life. And that's the thing you should focus on first if you got to, if that's the major part. And, and I wouldn't worry so much about the debts. So, what, for example, when I left my wife, I was in debt. It was very hard to make any 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 progress on my finances. But things were so bad with her that I I, I knew it would get even worse. And I was right about that. But I knew I had no chance of a good life with her. So I let. I didn't worry so much about the finances. I just rolled with the idea of, you know, I've got to get away from her and, and, and create a good life for myself and we'll let the finances sort themselves out with time. And that's exactly what happened. The finances have sorted themselves out with time. And it's your finances are simple because all you got to do is keep working and all you got to do is pay your bills on time and all you got to do is, is do that and they will improve they will improve and you may have to make all kinds of adjustments lowering your living standards substantially you know begging for money here and there uh asking for more time to pay things rearranging your debt so you can pay them longer over time at a smaller amount uh scaling back your desires and your wants to something within yourself at the at the time you're at and you, it will all improve with time. So give those ideas some thought all for now.